I got all my bags packed here. I got my luggage and my carry-on. I got everything in there, guys. I got the GoPro, I got the drone, I got my DSLR, I got a laptop. I got, I brought way too much stuff. I got everything. So we're about to head to the airport. Let's do this. Going to Florida, dude. Yeah. Hell yeah. It's also prohibited for you to consume alcohol that you may have brought with you on today's flight. Federal aviation regulations require passenger compliance with all items. Alright guys, we're finally here. We're at the house we're gonna be staying at in Florida. We have this house all to ourselves. Come inside, take a look. I'm down here at the rental house down in Florida. We're spending a week down here on vacation and me and my buddy Jono are about to go riding today. So we flew our riding boots and our pants and everything down here in our luggage. We reserved a couple dirt bikes at the Sandlot Motorsport Park. So that's where we're gonna be going today. And uh, they got some tracks, they got trails. And I've never even ridden on a motocross track so I'm excited about that. We get to try it out today. You see we flew our boots down here. I've always wanted to travel and ride dirt bikes, so I'm excited to be down in Florida and have the opportunity to ride. All right guys, we're in the car. We're almost there, 10 minutes away. About to pick up our dirt bikes and uh, go riding. So we just signed our waivers and paid the riding fee. Now we gotta drive over to the uh, place to rent our bikes. We already reserved them ahead of time, so it uh, shouldn't be an issue. And VIP, <laughs> but they, uh, yeah, they have helmets and stuff down here. But I brought everything else. We both brought everything else besides a helmet. You can see our bikes over there, and uh, we just got to go through a little thing with the guy, and then we should be ready to rip.
but very sandy. These trails are awesome though. different we don't usually ride this much sand so the trails are really sandy but these bikes have sand tires so it's not as hard to handle as I would have expected Just dumped it in the sand. <laughs> I had to tie this plastic back on because it broke off. But they were the plastics were already like half broken off. So it's not my fault. It's so hot out here. We're just dripping sweat and we've been out here 10 minutes. <laughs> Alright, back to it. This sand is takes a lot out of you and it's hot. It's so hot here. Should probably keep going that way. Good. 
right guys we just got finished riding some trails those trails go forever that's craziness that's sand something new never done sand before but we're gonna go over and check out the beginner motocross track because i don't ride motocross but i want to give it a shot since they have a track so we'll go see what it's like are you gonna try it or no i think so i kind of want to take my backpack off I'm afraid someone's gonna steal it though
beginner. Too sketchy for me. <laughs> Dude, I almost got destroyed. <laughs> These jumps don't have fucking. They're doubles, they're not tabletops. Yeah, I can't roll it. No. Dude, it was so steep, and I'm like, I don't know, so I slowed way down, and it just dropped straight up, and I was like, oh! <laughs> My face is on fire! here in checkers i've never eaten at checkers before i'm gonna get something to eat we gotta go pick up my we gotta go pick up my buddy jeff at the airport tonight around 9 30 he's flying in so we're gonna have another guy down here to hang out with and uh pretty excited he's coming down but we're gonna get some dinner here at checkers and then we're gonna be going to the airport no lighting we got in here not too bad <laughs> nice <laughs> dude i've been farting the whole ride i haven't smelled one <laughs> I just recorded that. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> so we're at the Tampa International Airport. My buddy Jeff just landed, and uh, we're waiting for him to go through baggage claim. Tits. What do you think? 